everyone, my name is Rachel Rieger. I'm a dental hygiene student from the 2022 graduating class at the University of Manitoba. I am very honored to have been selected as this year's outstanding student and it is my pleasure to be able to have this opportunity to acknowledge two individuals who have played a role in the student that I am today, the person who I am today, and the person who I will come to be in the future. Those people are Elena Spence and Kaylee Warden. Growing up in a small rural community, elementary school only went up to grade eight. Then it was time to take the bus down the highway to Beauxjour, Manitoba, where I completed my high school education at E. Cole Edward Schreier School. I remember being in elementary school and we had a guest speaker coming from the high school to speak to our class. This was Miss Spence. She was this fun, energizing person who irradiated everyone in the room and I couldn't wait until I grew up so that I could sit in one of her classes because I knew I was gonna learn so much from her. Now fast forward quite a few years and I found myself in her grade 11 and 12 classes. She had this way of making teaching fun, interactive, and keeping everyone engaged. Not only was Miss Spence my teacher, but she was also my coach. And let me tell you, I will never forget those 7 a.m. cheerleading practices. They definitely build character. There was one year that our team was invited to participate in a competition at West Edmonton Mall. Miss Spence planned our whole trip a week away from school where we also got to do lots of touring and sightseeing. This is my first time in the mountains and I'm so glad she incorporated this vacation into our school trip. I remember the long drive back to Beauxjour, we had an upcoming test in her class the following week. She sat with me and some other students in the class and helped us study for hours, truly going above and beyond. Now entering the dental hygiene program back in the fall of 2020, I was feeling a range of emotions from incredibly excited to also very nervous and scared. There's one individual whose presence stuck out to me instantly and that person is Kaylee Warden. From the very first day in her class, she had this way of easing my emotions and I instantly felt a large sense of comfort. From day one, Ms. Warden has always put in the effort to get to know the students on a personal level, as the first thing we did in her class was talk about how we spent our summer. She also always made learning fun by holding the occasional virtual scavenger hunt. I think these are the little things that really began the bond that I developed with her as my teacher. Moving into my senior year in the dental hygiene program, I was very happy and excited to learn that Ms. Warden was going to be my class advisor as well as my clinical coordinator. Truthfully, I don't know how I would have made it through this year without her. From getting my whole dental hygiene education in a pandemic to a university strike and all the bumps in the road between, Ms. Warden has always been there to provide reassurance and was always ready to pivot to a plan B. She always referred to me and my classmates as her cubs, which is funny considering I've always looked at her as a parental figure, always being there for guidance, answer all of my questions, and in a sense, take care of me. There was never a day where I didn't know that I was in the best of hands and that everything was going to work out in the end. Ms. Warden is one of the most kind, intelligent individuals that I have ever had the pleasure of knowing. I look up to her as both a professional and as a person, and I'd be so fortunate if I could be half the person who she is someday. She's impacted my life in more ways than I can probably say, and I'm forever thankful for all that she's done for me. There are so many wonderful teachers and instructors who I've been so fortunate to get to learn under, and I wish I could acknowledge all of them because they all truly deserve it. I would not be who I am today without having crossed paths with each of these individuals, especially Ms. Spence and Ms. Warden. I want to thank them both from the bottom of my heart and let them know just how much of a difference they've made in my life.